Hey guys, I'm back and it's I know it's been quite a while since I uploaded like a real video like me interacting with the camera, you know. Well, I want to tell you why. I went on a five day vacation to St. Augustine and I for one I thought it would be really boring because like I had all these things from my friends saying, Oh, it's lame, it's boring, it's ugh. I loved it. The museums are so much fun. There's so much old poop. <laughs> but I'm not kidding. I went to the Believe It or Not Museum and there was um dinosaur poop. Like fossilized. So, <laughs> But I loved it. It was, it, yeah, it was, it was raining every day. And it was like super hot. But the hotel was amazing. We had an indoor pool. Like every day at 8 p.m. we'll go there and we'll swim till 11 because the pool was open till like 9 a.m. till 11 p.m. so yeah anyway as you can tell by the title this is a fashion ha haul uh, these clothes I did not get them all at St. Augustine I got like a few things like some bracelets and a shirt but like these are all the sh clothes I have acquired during summer break. Oh, anyway, how's your summer break going? Tell me in the comic session. Not you, Carol, because I know how you're doing. So let's get started. Uh, this bracelet is, I'm guessing it's horse hair. It's like really soft, but I say it's horse hair because it, I don't know. I get it at the flea market. It was like a dollar at St. Augustine. I thought it was like real boho, so I, I loved it. If you don't know what boho is, just ignore what I just said. It's. Ugh. I got this at Bath and Body Works, also in St. Augustine. Uh, for most of you that know me, I love cats. I adore them. I love them more than dogs. I had a pet dog, but I never own a cat, but I still love cats more than dogs. And it's, uh, strawberry herbis, uh, I'm gonna butcher that. It smells so good and it's super cute and it has this little thing so you like clip it to whatever you want, like a purse. I got these sunglasses, um, at Body Central, also at St. Augustine. I got them because I always loved that fashion with the, like, brick. British flag on it like I just think their colors and the way their pattern is like you can put that on anything and I'll wear it <laughs> I also oh god no don't get tangled up uh wait one second okay. I also got this cute like little girly necklace at St. Augustine but this one was at the flea market this really nice guy sold it to us for I think this was like three five dollars and it's a rock it's not wood it's really cute I like it and also it's like a charm bracelet thing so I can like take it off and put it on the bracelet this is my most fragile thing I ever bought there and it's not really fashion but I thought I'll show you guys anyway because I've been like showing it off to everyone I'm like oh look what I got <laughs> I absolutely love it, and I love the color and stuff. It's so beautiful. It's a blue sea star. It's not natural blue. It's like airbrushed. I'm guessing it was like a white-ish. But it is a real sea star. That's why I say it's the most fragile thing I have. I, you can tell because of the thing right there in the back. I absolutely love it. I'll wrap that back up later. I'll just put it away. Uh, I got this necklace. Not at St. Augustine. I got this starfish at St. Augustine. But this wasn't at St. Augustine. This was Orlando, Florida. Um, at um, Body Central. They had a mustache one. And I really loved it. But it, the mustache was broken. So... Second choice. Oh, so sorry, buddy. I got 
these leggings at Ross, was it? Yeah, Ross. Um, it was really cheap, but I loved, I loved it. Most of you that know me, everyone, like, I like to dress, like, really high-end and chic. People think, like, my clothes are, like, really expensive or something. Nah, I get them at really run-down stores. <laughs> and this skirt, I haven't worn it yet, but I know exactly how, where I'm going to wear it. I might wear it today, actually. I got this at Old Navy. I don't like Old Navy that much. Like, I don't like their clothes. It's, uh, but when I saw this skirt, I fell in love with it. And I thought it was just so it, uh, there was like a purple pink one and it was hideous and then I saw this brown one and I'm like oh that's real cute I'll wear that <laughs> and I got these shorts uh, also in Old Navy they were um, black and I saw and I liked the pattern but I just wish they were like pink but still I love them they're really cute and I wish I could wear these to school but dress code but whatever, I'll wear them out on the street. This shirt. Oh, crap. Crap, crap. One second. Okay, this shirt, it's not like pretty. But I got it at St. Augustine, as you can tell by the backwards letters. Um, it's a butterfly. And I know it's like really ugly and non-colorful. But I got this with a bunch of different things at this one store. It was like five fifteen dollars, and the the cool thing is that the butterfly it changes color with um UV light, which is um sunlight. So if I go out and I wear this, it will like turn all kinds of pinks, yellows, and stuff. Really cool. I also got that with a bunch of nail polish, but I got those put away. But this pearl nail polish that I'm wearing right now. It's like a really ugly white right now, but when I go in the sun, it turns into a pretty light pink, and I really like it. This were a pair of black legging things that I haven't worn yet. My grandma got them for me. She's actually in the house right now. She is um, cooking or something. I don't know. But thank you. They're from Puerto Rico. These pants, also, I haven't worn them. I don't know what I'm going to wear them with. I really don't like the color orange on pants. But, hey, okay. Thank you for that, too, Grandma. Also, Puerto Rico. Okay, um, this was a handy-down from my mother. She, she, I, yeah, I've seen her wear this a few times. But I really like it because it's, like, real cute and stuff. And it's, like, innocent girly thing and I love the back and yeah now that I see this I forgot to bring out one more thing this is also a handy down I like it it's I don't I don't know how to describe it I just saw it and I'm like ooh look at that uh, this is also a handy down I like the cross thing and then I see the back and I'm like oh wearing that to school and before you guys say anything, I will wear a tank top under it. Thank you. And I absolutely adore this shirt. I haven't worn it yet because I have nothing to wear it with. Um, but this was, uh, I think this one was, yeah, this one was from my grandma, also from Puerto Rico, TJ Maxx. If you ever been to a Puerto Rican TJ Maxx, way better than an American TJ Maxx, I'll tell you that. Oh, this shirt, I got it from Ross, too. It's really cute. I like the opening, and at the bottom here, you can uh, tie it in a little knot. And uh, I like how the gold, like, bronze buttons on it. It gives it a little age. And I'm never going to iron that shirt. I like it with the wrinkles. And you guys might recognize this shirt from my St. Augustine videos. My mom got this for me. Um, I, I don't know where. She tends to buy me clothes without me knowing. But I love it. Uh, I haven't worn this yet. But I'm pretty sure I am soon. Probably. But I like it. I got it at 
uh, Old Navy. Did I? No, no, no. Um, I'm going to butcher this name, so I'm not going to say it, but I'll just put the tag in the camera. Ah. This store, if you guys can read backwards, I'm going to try Charlotte Ross. Rose. Ross? Uh, I'll just put it, like, not a link in the description, like, a, oh, fuck. I'll just put, like, the name of it in the description, and you guys will figure it out. But I don't like shopping at that store that much. But it's okay. It's a nice store. This also a handy down for my mom. At the top it has like the little gold chain thing with a star going on. <sighs> I'm not sure if I'll wear that. I just wanted it for some greedy reason. And this shirt is not on its hanger. Why not? You are making things very difficult for me. It's probably going to fall off its hanger again. Okay, got it back on. This was also a handy down. I'm so gonna wear this. The back opens up. And I like the design in the front. It's like super. Well, I think. Yeah, I think I can show you the nail polishes. Like, I don't think that's too much to ask, right? Oh, shit. Okay, this one, it's like a glittery, palish color, yellowish. Well, not yellowish, it's like a peach. So it'll like blend with your nails. And this one, I think it turns red. Yeah, this one turns red. And this one is the one I have on. As I said, it um, turns pink. But these things were like $5 a piece. And this blue sparkly one, it turns purple. So that's pretty much it. Except for like perfume and stuff that I got. But I'm pretty sure you guys aren't interested in that. Uh, oh, and also we stole some soap from the hotel, which is always nice. But if you're just being curious, uh, oh, I also got this bracelet. It comes with two others, but I lost them already. I got this, if you're interested. It's, um, I don't know. And I absolutely love this one. It's new. I, like, only wore it once, though. So, for most of you that go to school with me, um, be expecting a lot of things that I just showed you. Because I do wear everything that I own and if I don't wear it it's because I think it's ugly no offense to anyone that's bought me anything and I never wore it well that's been t for today I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your summer vacation and if you have a job or something sucks for you unless you're making money <laughs> well uh, stay awesome Gotham I become such a big nerd. Oh, if you guys are wondering why I always look like this in um, my, my videos, I don't think I should dress up or anything for a video. I mean, we're all friends here and stuff. What else did I want to say? Um, oh, yeah. Uh, most of you might remember this video that I made popping the boom. 85 views. 85. From for one video that wow love everyone that watched the video and that stayed watching the video and everyone that enjoyed the video um I'm pretty sure some weird perverts just clicked on it because of the oh uh, the picture that the video showed but whatever thank you but I I only still have five subscribers let's get that up ten. Tell your friends, tell your mother, tell your father, your uncle. Yes, I even want perverted junk Uncle John on here. Tell everyone. Thank you. Bye.